Our other top story tonight, a leaked memo from MGM Resorts gives us a look at what CEO Jim Murren has to say about litigation over the one October mass shooting. Earlier this month, the company filed a lawsuit against the victims of the shooting. Now the CEO is setting the record straight about the move. Brittany Edney has the letter from Murren, and Brittany, what's he saying? Well, this letter from Murren to MGM Resorts employees, which we did receive from Vital Vegas, well, it addresses recent backlash over the perceived notion that the company is suing victims of 1 October. MGM Resorts filed nine lawsuits in eight states to try and establish that the company isn't liable for what happened during the 1 October tragedy and to move any cases related to the mass shooting to U.S. District Court. However, CEO Jim Murren is apologizing to company employees about how things were handled. In this leaked internal memo, he writes, quote, I know the way things have been portrayed has left many feeling confused, hurt, and disappointed. I am sorry for that, and I am grateful to have this opportunity to clarify. He states that the company is not suing victims for damages or monetary payment in any way. Let's go and that more than 2,500 people have filed or threatened to file claims against MGM resorts across multiple courts in multiple states. Mirren says if things move forward that way, all involved would, quote, face the need to testify over and over again, traveling throughout various courtrooms across the U.S. in trial after trial. That scenario would place an unnecessary and painful burden on all those affected, adding that bringing all the cases in front of a federal court will, quote, provide an opportunity for closure in a swift and fair manner. We have reached out to MGM Resorts for comment about this leaked memo, and while they confirm that it is authentic, they say that they don't have anything else to add. Very Sasha. interesting. Thank you so much, Brittany. Well